In today's question, we have two intersecting triangles. One is triangle DAB, another is triangle CGB. Given is this particular area is 36 centimeter square. This area is 20 centimeter square. These two triangles have equal areas and we have to find value of X. Let's see the solution. So for construction, we'll join C and A. And let's call this area as Y. Now we know that CG here is a median and a median divides triangle in two equal areas. So we can say that the area of triangle CAG, that's this yellow triangle, this will be equal to area of triangle CGB, that's this blue triangle. So this CAG, this area is Y plus X plus 20. This area will be equal to X plus 36. So both the sides X will get cancelled down and will get value of Y as 16 centimeter square. So here we have replaced Y with 16. Let's do one more construction and join DG. Let's call this area as Z and thus here the remaining area that will become 36 minus Z. Now here in the triangle ADB DG, DG is acting as a median and thus median divides triangle in two equal areas. So we can say area of triangle ADG that is yellow triangle. This will be equals to area of triangle DGB. So we can say here Z plus X plus 20. This will be equals to 36 minus Z. We'll simplify it and we'll get Z as 16 minus X by 2. We'll use this observation later on. To get value of x, we need to have one more relation between x and z. For that, let's take the line segment AD. On this line segment, these are the two triangles which are formed, triangle ACE and ECD, which are sharing the same line segment and thus and same vertex. And thus the height for both the triangle is same. And we can say that the area, the ratio of the area will be same as the ratio of their basis. So we can say here AE upon ED that will be same as ratio of the area 16 and X. Why? Again because their height is same. For both the triangle height is same and thus ratio of base is same as ratio of areas. Same can be said for the triangle which are forming below that is triangle AGE and EGD. Their vertex is same and they are on the same baseline. <coughs> So we can say AE upon ED will be same as 20 plus X upon Z. So we'll compare the ratios to get 16 by X is equals to 20 plus X upon Z. Let's cross multiply it. We'll get 16 times Z is 20 X plus X square. And of course, we'll put the value of Z from here in this equation. So this 2 and this 16 will get cancelled. It will give me 8 times of 16 minus x. This is equals to 20x plus x square. Let's take all the terms on one side and simplify it. We'll get a quadratic equation x square plus 28x minus 128 equals to 0. We'll solve it by splitting the middle term. So this 28 will split as plus 32 and negative 4. So we'll get factorization as x plus 32 times x minus 4 is equals to 0. Of course, x can't be negative. So x is equals to 4. And that's our solution that x is 4 centimeter square. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I'll see you in next video. Till then, tata. Bye bye.